Hey there toy enthusiasts, welcome back to toys that made us happy. Today we have a special treat for all you Power Rangers fans out there, we are going to review these Power Rangers Master Morpher and Yellow Power Morpher of Lightning collection from Hasbro. I have just gotten Master Morpher last week. And it would be great to review both of them together. In memories of Thai Trang acted as Triny Kwan and Jason David Frank acted as Tommy Oliver. I would share to these wonderful morphers. If you guys have watched other videos about their review on the same morphers, please stay tuned for my opinion and share something that blown your mind. Well, before we begin, I would like to encourage everyone to subscribe my channel, as I will do a lots of review on my collections and future hauls as well. Thank you for your time to watch my other videos, I am really appreciated and please comment your thoughts so that I could keep in touch with everyone. Now, let's review them together. Let's begin with the Yellow Power Morpher. It comes with four power caps, five power coins including the Sabertooth Tiger, Morpher Buckle and Morpher Collection Base Stand. Let's review them all, and also their each sound effects on different coins. It's Morphin Time! Yeah. 
心。Next is the Master Morpher. It comes with 6 power coins, Morpher Buckle and Morpher Collection Base Stand. This Morpher appeared in Power Rangers Super Ninja Steel Episode 10, called Dimensions in Danger, where Tommy and other veteran rangers were captured for ranger cloning. Well, I don't prefer to spoil you with this information. If you are keen to know more, please watch this episode on Netflix if it is still available. Alright then let's review them all, and also their each sound effects on different coins. It's Morphin Time!
<laughs> Go on. Keep trying. See what happens.
Ranger, Tiger Power! <sighs> In conclusion, these morphers are great and not heavy. The coins are perfectly fine with me as the design that Hasbro made is to minimize the weight load of the morpher, and it is suitable for those who want to do a cosplay. Although some of the reviewers might think it made in cheap material, but in my opinion, actually people prefer lightweight items just like carrying a laptop. The only minus is that the yellow morpher would better if Hasbro used the actual actress voice, instead of random female voice. Just like the master morpher. Is it worth it or not? You decide. That's it for today's review, folks. If you are first time watch on my channel, please subscribe and press the bell for more awesome toy reviews. And also if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to Toys That Made Us Happy for more awesome toy reviews, unboxings, and assembly guides as well. Until next time, and remember, keep collecting and stay happy. Goodbye.